Space Muffins. It's Spacey Sims, and we are back with another installment of The Sims for Blackwell Crest, a Highlander Legacy, After the Warehouse. And I totally realized I did not say After the Warehouse in the last part. Dang. Uh, mm, if I remember, I'm going to go back and edit that in because I'm recording these parts back to back because we're getting two parts this week. Whee! Are you excited? Um, I actually don't even have the time to record all of my stuff uh, because it is so late right now on Saturday and I have family visiting tomorrow and I really have like five, five other things that I have to record, which I'm not getting done tonight, So, but whatever. We'll get them done. But I really wanted to do another part just because... Everly aged up in the last part, so we didn't see what she looked like, and I spent way too much time. Um, I was like, I'm going to add a table in the kitchen so they have enough room, and then I was like, uh, no, I'm just going to redo the whole entire kitchen, and then I did her room and her future sister's room, and now I'm like, you know what? Whatever. Anyway, so we're going to record second part. So this is Everly. She's cute, and you know what? <gasps> I left that hair on her because it was gorgeous. Um, I just made it the light brown color instead of the darker brown with gray because that was just weird. But um, And I just changed her eyes to a different shade of brown. Um, but look, I left the gloves on her and I matched her outfit to that because, like, look at this. She is, like, she's quirky. So, like her brother. But she's got her little kicks on, her little black socks, her little pink and black kitty thing. I mean, it's just friggin' she's just adorable. She's freaking adorable. Um, but anyway, yeah. So, also I realized, crap, they have to have seven kids. With the two of them, that's nine. We can't have that many Sims in the house. But what if Boston is like the cutest of their children and I want him to be the heir? Crud. So, I might have to get a mod that lets you have more than eight Sims in a household. I didn't want to do that because I don't... I don't want to have so many Sims that it bogs down my game. But in this case, I might need it just for this uh, house. Um, but anyway, what are you doing? Read to a child for two hours. What's she doing? How's her? Oh, she's going to go play with her brother, so whatever. Um, <laughs> Candy is at work, and oh, we have no idea if she's pregnant. That's right. I thought, oh, we're going to have a baby in this part, but I don't even know if she's pregnant because we tried and failed and tried again. Um. Oh, anyway, let me show you while they're wandering around doing nothing. This is the kitchen. I spent a lot of money, so we only have 60 grand. We had almost close to 100, so that just tells you what. So, I added this table in here. I changed the door, too, so instead of being whatever color it was, it's not blue. Um, so, I added this table. I've only got enough room for eight, because whatever. Um, but there you go. There's their table, and I kind of matched it, sort of, and I redid their kitchen. Um, so, they've got... Lots of cute decor and everything and all these little wall shelves and whatnot. And they've got an ice cream maker and a popcorn maker. And then we've got over here, this is the fridge and the stove and the sink. And I love this, like the little pots and pans kind of around this little island. So the island also has places to sit. And we got like, you know, so this is on either side. And then these bookshelf thingies, which I didn't put too much decor on. I didn't put any decor on, actually, um, but whatever. Um, I really wanted this to be, like, a nice, like, a long table area. Um, but, unfortunately, so you could put the popcorn maker on it, like, almost like a buffet table thing. But you can't put appliances on freaking tables. It's annoying. Um, so, anyway, but then this is their coffee area and their microwave and stuff like that. So, that's their kitchen. It's beautiful. I'm happy with it. You know, I could have spent way more time, but I didn't. Um... That I'm happy with the amount of time that I did spend. And then this is the girls' room. I put two beds in here to start with. So they've got their beds. It's all in pinks and blacks and stuff like that. So, uh, And then Everly, I designed after, and I was like, oh, well, look at that. She matches because the black and pink. And I was like, oh, she matches her room. So. so they've got, like, their little bed and everything. I didn't put a rug in here, and I should have, but I was like, whatever. Um, And then this cute little closet -y thing. I think you can actually put stuff on the shelves, but I didn't. Yeah, I don't know if they can actually use this as a... Because I... The chair... Like, normally with a desk, when you move it in by mode, like, it moves the chair with it, and this didn't, so I don't know if they can actually use this. But, you know, I gave her a tablet 
or whatever and so just a little decor like that and then this is perfect because we can add another girl's bed here and like one here if we really need to or something um and I didn't do anything to Boston's bedroom except for really I added these two posters but if we have another boy we'll add another bed you know whatnot we'll have to put the beds over here you know um, and then we'll have to see, depending on, I, I feel like we can fit more girls than boys, but we can rearrange his bedroom. But, uh, and then you guys were here, I did this all on the thing, and I didn't decorate or anything like that, because we need to make more money. But we will at least have that, and I kind of feel like over the generations we'll build up the house and decorate and do more stuff. So, like, you know, at some point, you know, so we've done the kitchen with them, and we'll do the kids' bedrooms, but of course, you know, as the kids age up, and move out and like the next generation we can like work on okay they can do the living room and then we'll do the and then like so I don't expect Gideon to have this house decorated but we're gonna do it a little over time so Candy is dead tired everybody else seems to be doing fine he's tired so he should probably go to bed you should probably go to bed kiddo hold on but anyway so I know, you're like addicted, you're like a crack addict with playing, but it's not going to work. Where is she? Huh, where have you been? Oh, you're going to go talk to your dad. That's actually good. Let's have him read to you. Does he have a, the book in his inventory? No, he doesn't. I don't know what he did with it. Maybe he actually put it away. Um, open. Where's the kid's book? What's this one? Is this a kid's book? Didn't we, we already read that one. Read to child. Let's read to Everly. Because you need to read to a child for two hours, so. So, and, you know, this will help. This is so cute. I really wish we had a better light. I mean, this is like a reddish brown. It's really pretty. I like it. But I wish we had more brown colors. You know, like, we have a really... I don't really like the yellow gold br the yellow blonde color because everybody has yellow hair but I mean I guess if you dyed it yellow but still I don't know I don't really like that one but we have like a night like the really like the white blonde and then like a deeper blonde like a sandy what is on her head our new Kruba do you see that that's when she moves what is this our new Kruba Trobar I think it's a nose piercing. Uh huh. Um, let's go into CIS for a second. I think I hate that because that's like the same as um, like they have the custom content eyes. Skiba, you move. Does he get chubby? Gideon, are you getting chubby? He looks like he's getting chubby. Uh, okay. So let's go like this. Let's go to the accessories. I don't I don't know what a nose ring accessory, but you can't even see it, but wait. Hold on, let's just age her up for a second. She should be. I would think. Do I have nose rings anywhere? I know I have. I know I downloaded them. I just don't know what they're technically categorized as. I mean, so I have those, but like, I, I don't know. They're not in that. So I don't. I don't know what category they're in and why. Accessories like they're not bracelets. She already has leggings and socks. I, I don't know, but it looks like it's like a nose ring, but at the same time, it's like... Okay, let's just take off all accessories, and then let's just put her necklace back. It doesn't really... It's not really that bad, at least, but it's really weird, because, like... Yeah. Okay. I don't know if that worked. I, I don't know where they are, and they shouldn't work for kids, because... But... <laughs> And that's just so weird, like, people who do custom content, it's like, if, if you're gonna enable it for kids, it needs to be done so it's, like, actually on a child. Not, I don't know why people give their kids nose rings, but hey, I mean, what the hell? <laughs> I actually think that may be fun, like, 
I would never do that to a real child, but it's The Sims, for God's sakes. But, like, but then it's, like, floating up here, and it's like, I can't... What? I mean, she had those fake custom... Like, he's got in his oh, nude outfit, parts, like, uh... <laughs> no, no, it's still there. Whatever it is. Maybe it's just... I have no idea. Like, it was there. <laughs> Yeah, you, you could, you can see, I, I'm losing my mind, but there it is. It's like a nose ring or something. I don't under, okay, I don't know. I don't know, whatever. So she's got a weird glowy thing on her head, but okay. Oh, she needs an activity table. Oh, sorry, kiddo. We got nothing for you. We don't even have any toys, do we? Oh, Gideon. You need to clean that when you're done. Um, that's actually true. Like, we don't have any stuff for the kids. Oh, my God. So here's half the episode is me going into, like, doing this. And I wanted to find out if she was, like, pregnant and whatnot. But, you know, we'll just make this, like, a longer one. Um, actually, we need... You know what? I'll actually put this in her room. We'll actually put it in here. Oh, this is cute. Okay, cool. Because, like, when they grow up, we can remove this stuff. So we have that. We have a kid's guitar kind of a thingy. We need to put some... He's got some toys, which is fine. He doesn't actually play with them, but... Do we have a big... We need, like, a big... I feel like we need a big unicorn. Oh, you know what? Can we put him here? <gasps> That's, like, perfect! Aww. Aww. Yeah, because I don't want just the... Yeah, we'll get the purple one. That's cute. And we could actually put... He's got a llama and a race car. We'll put a toy in here. Let's give them... Let's put the... Oh, yeah, on his desk. Let's put the action figure girl. There we go. This way they have some toys. Um... Because kids need toys. Oh, I forgot about this. Uh... Oh, somebody just popped out. Is that Kala? Yes, it is. I just want to make sure they're still here, but they should all still be here. Oh. She's going to be like, what's up? And I totally forgot we have a basement. Like, look at all this cool stuff we can decorate. And do down here and, like, make all this fun stuff and, like, renovate. Oh, I was like, Steve? Oh, Stevie and Marcus. Okay. Okay. For a minute, I was like, yeah, go game! <laughs> she's feeling happy for Mark. Why don't you take a pregnancy test, though? If she's not pregnant, we're going to have to get her the... Uh, she doesn't have enough satisfaction points, but we are going to need to do, like, fertility treatment or something. Because, like, girlfriend ain't getting pregnant. Oh, God, Calla, don't walk in. Lord. <laughs> Good God, Kella's boobs are huge. I don't even... Yay! Good. Okay. So, hopefully we have the baby in this part. It took forever. Oh, she's tired and grungy. Why don't you come here and take a shower? Um, and then... Yeah, because you are stinky, girl. What is she doing? She's not even watching TV. She's totally glitched. She's listening to a story and he stopped reading to her. I don't know when he did, but... Oh my god, that's so funny. Go pee. And then get something to eat. When you're done, you need to get something to eat too before you go to bed. Oh my good lord. There's her nose ring. <laughs> Why don't you get something to eat? Everyone else is going to get something to eat. So, yeah. Okay, so, of course, it's funny. Everly now has been around for long enough. And she has yet to see the ghost. I love this freaking kitchen. It makes me want to cook so badly. It's so pretty. It would be a pain in the ass to have to dust these shelves, though.
I do not dust, so. No, you're gonna eat these chips and salsas. Eat the chips and salsa! No, it makes me want chips and salsa. I don't have that, though. Um, I really want Mexican now. Ooh. Anyway, so, I was like, whoa, oh my god, she just found out she's pregnant and she's huge already. Do you have twins in there? Do you have twins in there? Are we gonna have a C and a K? CK. Okay. She's like, hey, talk to my kid. I'm just going through this a little fast so that they can finish eating their food and then whatnot. And then when she's done, I'll send her to bed. Don't go to bed yet. Finish eating before you go. Good. Thank you. Are you done with this? I'll take this for you. Where did I put the trash? It's over here now. It's in the wall. No, okay. I couldn't get it to go. Taking that. No! Damn it! I told you to go to bed, not wash dishes. Go to bed before you pass out. So, now Gideon is in bed. Everyone is in bed. She needs to have some social. No, don't talk to your mom. Talk to the ghost. So here she is, minding her own business, and this ghost is cleaning out our dishes. Go introduce yourself to the ghost lady. Who just dropped dishes on our floor, but that's fine. We'll take these. Because we get money for these, and we need money. 40 bucks! She's like, hi! Who are you? She's like, my name's Callum. She's like, I died here. She's like, hmm. She hasn't gone to school yet, but you know. She's not a dumb kid. She's like, your clothes look a little too modern for you to have died hundreds of years ago. She goes, have you been haunting this place long? Callum's like, no, not really. And it's hard for her, because, you know. You know. Kellis, like doesn't want to tell this kid, like, um, there's a lot of us that live here, and... So, but, you know, so she's chatting with this ghost, and, of course, the ghosts, I suppose Gideon has told them, like, do not tell my children what is going on here. I will explain it to them when they are older, but they are not old enough. He's like, don't talk to my kids. Don't even show your face. Well, he can't say that. You know. He knows he has no control over them. Even though he's asked. He's probably asked them, like, hey, could you not, you know, you know, could you not show your face to my family? Like, I don't want them to know what's going on. But, of course, they're going to do it anyway because they're, like, kind of pissed off. They're dead. It's not really Gideon's fault, and they know that, but, you know. But his family is very... I mean, there's lots of ghosts in this house, and they're just very in, th in tune. The kids especially. You know, because the kids are... The kids are the few... Well, the kids are how these ghosts are going to get released to the afterworld and be able to rest. So, of course, they're going to talk to these kids. You know? She's like, bye, I gotta go to bed. And then he's like, oh, hey! I haven't met you before. Has he met Kala before? I don't know if he's met Kala. I don't think he has. He's like, you're new. And she's like, oh, uh-huh. Um, oh, great. Oh, he's met Can Tanvi. He's the only one he's met. So he's... Oh. Wait. Uh. Oh, he knows Azure and Wes. How does she know Tanvi? Oh, when Tanvi was, when she was a baby. Right. Okay. Right. Da, da, da. So he is like wide awake. You know, these kids are way too in tune with ghosts. It's a little bizarre. Um, but yeah, so he does not get along with Kala very much. <sighs> Which one of you fools? You're getting up. You got to get up and you... No, no, shoot. That's not what I wanted to do. 
Oh well, it was only 60 bucks. I was like, ah, I wanted him to repair it. I don't want to constantly be like replacing things that the ghosts break because the ghosts are assholes. Pardon my French, but they are. Oh, freaking sweet Jesus. Kala, you suck. But this is also why, you know, so, you know, everyone's starting to notice, like, things are constantly breaking in this house. What is going on? <laughs> and, you know what? So, the first time they were actually trying for a child, and even though, I mean, I did try for a baby, but that's because I kind of have to in order to guarantee that she gets pregnant. Um, I don't want to do risky uh -huh. woohoo and not, you know... And have her constantly not pregnant because then we'd run out of time and we wouldn't have enough kids. But anyway, so he's not telling her that he's purposely trying. Like, this is a little shady, you know. He's he's like, you know, he's like, no, no, we're we're, we're fine. And then like, so she's now like, this is her third child, maybe third and fourth, who knows? Um, but uh, you know, so she's a little worried because you know she's had so many kids so fast like she's doesn't want him to be like whoa whoa you know whatever but you so said they've, they've never really talked about it so he obviously knows like he's hoping she has lots of kids and he hasn't quite he, he says he wants a big family so she's okay with the fact that like she's having lots of kids but at the same time it's like you know, she doesn't know exactly what the deal is, so Gideon really has to be honest with her, because she's starting to feel like she's going a little bit crazy here with, you know, the fact that she's seeing ghosts and everything. But I'm not sure if he's ever going to tell her, like, she sees ghosts and, you know, he's like, well, it's an old factory, you know, and... Of course, she hasn't told him about the ghosts yet. But it's going to come out because her kids are seeing these ghosts now. And. I think it would. I'm not, I'm not really sure if I want to do the first child or the last child or just we pick one. Um, so I think we're going to see them. I really want to add the mod. Uh, so we can have more than eight sims in the household just so we can have at least the nine of them in this household um because i i want to be able to see them all you know so like we can see like you know oh god okay boston's cute but oh everly's so much cuter or oh my god and we get to like whoever the next e is and it's like oh my god ah you know like i what happens if like boston is the cutest and they all turn out to be hideous after him well we're using him i mean we want the cutest one but, uh, you know. So. And it's Sunday, so that's cute that you're gonna go play. And I don't really give a crap if they, uh... <gasps> Girl, you need to pee. When you're done eating, go pee. I'm gonna take this from you. And I'm gonna throw this out. And Gideon, you are going to sell this. Well, go! That's why I told you to go pee! Hurry up before you wet yourself! Oh, girl, get out of the bathroom. Go here. I know you're trying to talk to your mom, but your mom's trying to pee. She doesn't want to talk to you. Her bladder's going to blow up. Ooh, oh my god, guys. I want to, like... From not being in a club gathering. Yeah, well, unfortunately... Sweet Pea... We can't. What does she want to do? She wants to get to know Boston and be friendly. So where is Boston? He's going to go out here and play. Is there a... There's stairs there and everything, but there's no doors. I wonder if there was originally doors here, and then they just maybe got... Did I delete them? I either deleted them, or... Like, they didn't... I also wonder if this is supposed to be not painted... I don't know. Uh, I just, you know, sometimes things are things are throwing me off here. At least he's running a shorter ways. Oh, hi, Paolo. What's up? Why is he visiting? I guess you can come in, Paolo. I don't know what your deal is. 
Wogrichard? Grenoble. Warba. Get to know. Uh. Share big news. I know. Like. I think he's realized that you're pregnant by now. If not, he just thinks you're really fat. Mom, you got fat! <laughs> pregnant brat. No. Oh, um. Ask him about school. Nabakuzip? Yeah, Vura! Ha ha, Quink! Yumbano Pelfin? Dawa? The Bay! Ho ho! Aww. <laughs> Cute. Wograchop? <laughs> Warba! Um, give him a hug. Goodbye! Battle Lenore! I love the, um. Burba, Vera! Express love. That's so cute. That's such a cute little hug. It's like, oh, it's a butt wiggle kind of hug. I love it. He's like, I think I want to be non committal. Oh my god, that's so cute. Look at the way. I love the way she's laughing with him. She's like, whoa! Oh. Mm, <laughs> I laughed so hard I puked. <laughs> Paolo, you just walked through the door. You gotta pee. Where's she? Play in. Oh, okay. We've got trash, obviously, that we need to, uh throw away. I love her so much. I just love her freaking clothes. She... Okay, I don't think I want to make all of their kids quirky, so I'm going to remember to, like, not do that next time. Look, oh, she's got the, the jitters. I got the jitters. Sorry, I had to blow my nose. Um, I really want to have this baby in this episode. This might be super long part. Um, her third trimester is in two hours. Um, let's just kind of, we're going to go a little bit faster through this right now. They're both trying to go play in something. All right. Cause I told him to replace. Oh, hey. Oh my God. Ah! Dad. Get out of my way, kid. They're all like. Is that death again? Wow, the Grim Reaper really is digging staying around here. Gideon should be like besties with Grimmy by now. He's like... This used to be the park, obviously. I destroyed the park. Forget the park. Oh my god, Candy, you gotta go to work. No, Candy, I don't want you... You're gonna... Um... Pause. Wait a minute. Where is... You can take a vacation day, but you can't take family leave? Huh. Well, I want her to take... Let's take a vacation day. Because you're about to pop, so you should, uh... So... Zorbo. So she should, like, tell him about a dream that she's... Okay, she's not... Okay, never mind. He just walked away, so whatever. That's so cute. She's like, I'm going to scoot over closer to my mom. How adorable. Why is Paolo still here? He's just like, whatever. Um, okay, I'm going to go faster through this. I know, but uh, we really want to... I really want to... Get to baby. You can't see, like, oh, that kind of stinks. I have, and maybe it's because I put a, a custom content skin, I don't know. Oh! There's our sister Yuki, who I did not know was our sister. Let's invite her in. Hey, Aunt Yuki's here. Auntie Yuki's here. 
He's playing. Let's see if she can. Yuki's still a teen, huh? Oh, he's going out to play. I was like, I thought he was playing, and then all of a sudden he was right here, and I was like, what is going on? Why do they have to go outside? She's like, I'm gonna be a teen before you grow up. What? Uh -huh. Invite Yuki to play a space monster. Oh, whoops. Okay, I was on him and I not her. Oops. Is she gonna come over and play a space monster? <gasps> That's so cute! Aww. She seems like all upset now. Um, come on, have this baby, would ya? Or babies. Have both of them. Have babies. You should probably go to sleep. Uh, what's your deal? Do you need anything? You need to take a shower, so I feel like you should come here and take a shower. You need to eat something, so you need to go eat. And you need to go to sleep. Oh. Sleep. Okay. So, let's go faster through this. I know. I'm sorry, guys. Like, I want to actually, like, get some, like, real play in and not, like, constantly speed through everything. <laughs> I love that. It looks awful, but whatever. Um, but I really want her to have the babies. I don't want to wait. I just can't wait. I can't wait a week. I can't wait a week, guys. What's this? Oh, no. I didn't see what night it was at the bar. Oh. I really want to have baby. Whoa, 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 whoa. That is not where we put our coffee mugs there, buddy. I know that was you. I'm going to blame Paolo for it, though. I don't know who made the coffee. I don't know who made the coffee. We keep like... Aw. Cute. They're watching I love this! I, okay, I do actually want it to, like, not be normal speed. I want it to be, like, faster speed. Is, is this how it was? Like, they're going through and the movie is not going faster speed. I don't like it when it blurs, but at the same time it's weird because I kind of thought, like... I, I don't know how the movies were before. I have no idea why that's sitting out, but that needs to go into the refrigerator. And she's gonna go to bed. Good. Um, okay, so she's in bed. Bye, Yuki. She's in bed. He needs to pee. And then I told you to go to bed. That's what I told you to do. Yeah, not drink coffee. You also go to bed. And then that's cool. We'll fast forward through some time. Not too much because unfortunately this kid's awake. She's gonna be awake. But ooh, candy. You made some good money on your day off. Good. Good lord, people belong there. Oh my god, can we have this baby? Oh, thank god. I was like, can we just have this baby already? All right, all right, all right, all right. So, we're going to have this baby and then we're going to end this part, but uh, let's see. Stop washing your hands and have this baby. Okay, good. Baby C is on the way. Boy or girl, boy or girl, boy or girl, or twins. It'd be hilarious if it was twins. It's a girl! Oh, 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 no, it's Blackwell, thank you. And so it is... Why is my... Oh, I was hitting caps lock, because I'm smart. Cassiopeia. Yes! Twins! Oh god, if she has triplets, I'm going to freak out. Okay, so we have our C and our K. <gasps> oh. Cassie and King. 
much. It's not. It's not. It's not moving. It's still paused. There we go. I was like, oh dear God. I did like Calyx, but. I actually liked Calyx and Callie for a girl, and that would have been perfect. Ka Calyx and Callie would have been very similar. Uh, if it had been the reverse. But, uh, this is what we got. Cool. Okay, so we need other names. Okay, because we have our C and our K. We will have... I have Easton as our E2. I don't know where the other baby is. Where is our... Where's... That's Cassie. Where's Cam... Oh my god, he's... That's not how it works, game. Um, oh my god. Okay. Okay, and is that one? Oh, it's perfect. It's green, too. Oh my god! And you know what's really funny? He, again, the boy has the lighter, like, the more really, really pale, like, candy skin tone, and the girl's got the darker, like, Gideon skin tone. That's freaking weird. Oh my lord, guys. Two babies. Okay. Well... That's that. We need other E names. I have Easton for a boy. So we need a female E name. And then we need T's. So we need two female T names and two males because we got E, T, and T to go. Woo! We have four of our seven kids and I'll get that mod so we could have more than eight sims in the house. And oh my god, next time we come back they should be Maybe they will age up. So, yeah. I'm sorry this part's super, super long, guys. I hope you're excited, though, that we had babies three and four. And, yeah, I will. Sorry. Bash my microphone. I will see you guys next time. Remember to give the video a big thumbs up and subscribe to see more.